Yeah, Jeff, the Wednesday night service here at the Church Power of God had a special meaning tonight. They had a service of gratitude that one of their pastors and the other passengers made it out of the plane's wreckage alive. Ramin Parsa was recording during takeoff when Aeromexico Flight 2431 suddenly slammed back down on the runway. The cell phone video went black, but screams and prayers could be heard from terrified passengers. It was pitch dark and we, st we started smelling a smoke. So we could not breathe, like uh, almost like, <gasps> like this, smoking like that. We're trying to break the window with our legs. Parsa is a pastor for the Iranian congregation at the Church Power of God in Reseda. He was among the 103 passengers and crew that survived. He explained what it was like inside the plane after it crashed. Imagine you put like 100 people in a room, in a dark room, pitch dark, with a filled with a smoke, and there's a small door, everyone's trying to find it. With the plane in flames, passengers could be heard coughing, crying, and hyperventilating after escaping the wreckage. Mexican officials say the control tower reported the jetliner descended abruptly as it attempted takeoff, possibly due to a severe gust of wind. The left wing appeared to hit the ground. The plane stopped more than 300 yards from the runway after losing its engines. It remained upright, allowing exit slides to deploy. Back at Parsa's church in Reseda Wednesday night, a prayer service for those who were on the plane. We're very grateful to God that uh, nobody lost their lives. Reverend Lupita Navarre says Parsa went to Durango after getting an invitation to preach at a youth camp. She believes his life and the others were spared because God has a bigger purpose for them. He's a man very passionate so people would know God in a personal way and that's his mission in life. Parsa is still in Mexico right now. He tells us he'll be back in L.A. very soon. Reporting live tonight in Reseda, Rachel Kim, CBS 2 News.